season one. Y'all two are questions. Hello, good human. Hello. Welcome to another episode of. Is a liar. You eat for breakfast. If the liar survives, he or she wins the entire prize. Okay, Brandon, yes. what do you eat for breakfast? This morning I had buckwheat, buckwheat hot cereal, add almond milk and some water. Okay. Who eats buckwheat in the morning? Like, I know people do, but I'm looking at him and his body language and how he's telling me, and I'm going, you just had buckwheat? I eat buckwheat every single day for breakfast, and I feel like that's a normal thing. But everyone acted like it was a weird thing. Um, I'll be honest, I eat everything on bread. I have to. Because, like, I just, I'm a recent vegan. I've been vegan for, like, five months. It's a challenge I did for myself. I have a question. Yeah. What are y'all's favorite restaurants? Did you guys check out? He just, he just, he diverted the question. He just changed the question to, to divert attention away from the breakfast. So he's in trouble. In North Hollywood, is this, like, awesome? It's really, it's Cajun vegan. Oh yes, uh, yes. You know, um, dude, I literally been taking. Oh my gosh, I talk, I took it? my friend Hannah. Or, uh, She's or, actually or, a big or, YouTuber something. as well. Everything that came out of his mouth was super random. Brandon, what's Cajun. your favorite like, restaurant? My favorite. Yeah. I go to Taco Bell all the time. Yeah. What do you get at Taco Bell? Taco I get Bell. a Crunchwrap, but swap out the beef and get some beans in there. So also I, swap out the sour cream and the cheese. And yeah. Don't they use eggs? Beans. Yeah, he lost. It's in their like in their wraps. I hope they don't. Yeah, but I hope they don't either I'm, because then that wouldn't be vegan. I don't know why she was coming at me. I don't know if it's like the way I look. I don't look like a vegan. No, it's like, who says Taco Bell if you're a vegan? I've never heard a vegan ever say, oh, I go to Taco Bell. I'd be like, huh, braggy? Um, why is everyone here a vegan? I'm vegan because I actually moved out here. I felt like I was like, all right, if I mess up, I can keep on doing it. So I challenged myself on five months in, and I was like, all right, I'm going to continue doing it. Because if you I guys, don't... we have four minutes left. Sorry, oh, to yeah, sorry you, but we have four that. minutes. Sorry. I want to hear from oh, other sorry. people. Sorry. I want to know. Reason I did it. That this this lady annoying as fuck. She is annoying as fuck. Let motherfuckers talk. Shut your bitch ass up. Fiend for fucking attention. Stupid can ass. You, because I wanted to can, can you, can you, just, we got, sorry, we got it? Sorry, you, let's go around. Yeah. Jalen was just taking up all the time so that I couldn't find any information Bro. about anybody. I'm vegan because of the environment. I think the meat and dairy industry just contributes way too much to our environmental issues. And so that's why I decided to go vegan. I've been vegan for almost three years. I kind of just followed like blogs and stuff. And then I found out I had like high cholesterol. I like cold turkey, just like, Put it. The more I learned about it and educated myself, the more I wanted to keep going. I initially went vegan for my health, for my skin. It's kind of helped. It hasn't helped that much, but I think just when I was doing it, I was like, why go back? Kind of like you, like I could do it, and I don't think there was a huge, like, pressing environmental factor. It was just like, I can do it right now, so That's why exactly go back? Doing. And it's like been good. So it's almost been like a year, so kind of similar to you. Good, good job, yeah. man. I uh, became vegan for um, animal SMH, cruelty reasons. She taking up too much it's a time whole doing bunch that. of stuff you know also you can go Dr. into, Stoner. but yeah, for animal reasons and environmental reasons. I'm gonna eat reasons. after this. So I've been vegan for almost 10 years combined. Um, started off when I was 21 years old. I was drinking heavily, and I just wanted to be feeling like better in my body, so. Took a yoga class, went vegan overnight, went raw vegan for two years, uh, became a raw food mm -hmm. chef. I'm a yoga teacher now. Um, yeah. I went vegan kind of as like a transition. I was pescatarian for 10 years. Um, and we have two minutes. Um, I so, want to, can we ask, <coughs> oh, not, I don't want to cut you off, yeah, but I want to ask specific so, questions to people. But. What is your favorite documentary oh. that helped you go with the. Oh, help me go vegan? I kind of watched like those YouTube ones. Which ones? Like what, what name one? I don't remember the names. I like saw them in the blogs that I was talking about and like. Which blog? Um, it was called. Nah. Nah. Redirect the question back to her. Redirect the question back to her. I'd be like, I don't know the blogs by name, but can you tell me some blogs and also some video sources? Which the with the whole HTML user L coding, please. And it has to be youtube.com forward slash watch the whole code, bitch. Because apparently you know everything, huh?
all. It was like this girl, her name is Emma. I gave her the sign, I like, hmm, you don't know what blog, you don't know what post, you don't know this, you don't know, you don't know anything. I watched the VR. This actually helped encourage me. And I watched um, from a first person perspective. Ooh, yikes. Yeah, um, cows getting oh, butchered. No from way. you could see them getting cut up. Six, Red lights. Five, five, so like four, that was three. really traumatizing. Do -do -do -do. <laughs> She had a little more makeup on and she had nail polish on and so I guess in my head I think vegans just go for the more natural sort of look. I was like looking for some cues and like what people were wearing and he was wearing like suede shoes. Most like vegans don't really wear leather. Hi. Nice to know you guys. <laughs> in the beginning, nervous and like when Aaron was it's soap that you use. Oh my gosh. I'm more vegan for like food related reasons. Maybe right, but stuff. typically like if you're vegan, yeah, then you know, know you use all your products I, that you love. I, oh, that's annoying. This bitch is annoying. I thought vegan was only food. So now she's even saying, oh, you can't wash your body with specific items. Damn, she a gatekeeper. I gotta find out where she lives cause I gotta eat a Taco Bell burrito in front of her ass. And I'm gonna make sure there's steak, Chicken, everything in that bitch. And I'm just going to chomp that shit down in front of her with a goddamn Sprite. I identify as vegan, but I do it more so for food-related reasons, not exactly. Because I, like, did it for my health. So I that's actually why. fully agree with you. Yeah. Do you wear leather? Uh, I don't own leather. Really. It's interesting. I own leather, but I don't buy leather. It's leather that has been bought years ago that I still have that mm. I feel is kind of, like, wasteful to, like... That's so fucking stupid! Do you own leather? Oh, if you own if you own a leather jacket, you're not a vegan. Like what? Away. The important thing is you don't buy yeah. leather because we vote with our dollars. Exactly. I think like in this circle, like there would still be people who like identify themselves. I haven't seen this bitch talk once until now. Who the hell is this? Who the hell is this? Vegan, even if it's like. Food so, related or like so, something else. Like the range, guess, like, but there's ethical. like levels, yeah. Yeah, but I think like the on man out wouldn't be someone who like yeah. is like me, like just doing it for food. Yes, yeah, yeah, you guys ask me questions too. She belongs in Dang and Rampa, bro. She look like a Dang and Rampa character, the veganist. Hiya, ting. How's everybody doing today? Just your local vegan, ting. I just want to let you guys know when you kill cows, you're a murderer. Just kidding. Not really, though. Put this bitch in dang rampa, dude. I like questions. We know you do. Do you eat honey? <laughs> dude, I actually, I don't even. Like I don't eat honey. True. Yeah, I, I don't. I the ultimate don't vegan. I eat honey, kind but honey isn't bad. vegan. I think they made. I hate her. I hate her. I hate her. I hate her. Oh my god! I. I, I want I want to know her friend circle. Th there's no way somebody's her friend. She is annoying as fucking hell, dude. Oh my goodness. It made me feel like my reason for being a vegan wasn't good enough because it wasn't coming from the same place that they were. I have a That's question. Cool. Yeah. So, okay, everyone think about their immediate circle. How many folks in your circle are vegan? I'm supported by my circle. Yeah. Like, they thought I was unhealthy at first because mm -hmm. I wasn't getting enough to eat. Mm -hmm. um, and I had horrible gas issues. Um, that was that was I was bad. But um, <laughs> I mean, I actually didn't dog. even know that was a thing. So, it's, it's, like, it's I mean. real dog. So far, you've said that you don't really consider yourself vegan because of the products you use, yeah. and then you like eat at Taco lying, Bell. I would like go like the extra mile and like lie and like say a lot of stuff. But you know, like I'm just like being real with you guys. Well, yeah, yeah. Like I try I'm, my best. So to, how like, many be how many years have you been vegan? Oh no, it's been like less than a year, like eight months. Actually, the, the fresco style at Taco Bell is supposed to be vegan. I did, he didn't mention that. He said that he got the taco and then he removed everything and then yeah. he mentioned that later on. I have seen vegan YouTubers who like go to Taco, taco Bell like and like can make it vegan, vegan just to show yeah. people that like it can be like About convenient. I don't know why you guys are <laughs> oh, just, <laughs> trying to yeah, tell me about it. Yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> Get her out. 
Get it out before I do it. Two minutes and left. Del Taco yeah. also has Del Taco, Del Taco the Beyond. has the Beyond Meat. Why don't you go there if you're vegan? I thought Erin was pretty aggressive. Yes. But in all the best ways for a game like this, like she asked all the like heavy hitting questions, which is exactly um, how it should have been. Anybody What's your favorite candy? My favorite candy? Most candies without gelatin in it. Nerds. Like name one. Name one. Nerd Sour name, Patch name Kids. One. Sour Patch Kids. Okay, those aren't yeah. vegan. I thought they were, but not sour patch do they kids. not have? Do they you said that they have gelatin in it. Nah, if it's if it's nah, you gotta say something that def like Sour Patch Kids, trolley gummy worms, gummy bears, marshmallows, all that shit has like some type of shit that's non-vegan. Dude, this bitch is bugging though. They have gelatin in them. I okay, maybe I'm not a vegan. I don't <laughs> like. I don't. I don't. He lost. <laughs> I thought they were. But I mean, you know. What's your favorite candy? I don't eat candy. Really? Oh, shut the fuck up. Same. Yeah, I don't. It didn't seem that his ethics and his values were in alignment with the diet because typically that. Bad branding. In community. Oh, so. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, I think he's like doubt. If the lights turn green, fill in the box and you lose. Okay, everyone looks nervous, so I feel a little bit more secure in this. Oh, shit. dang, oh. though. Found the most. Oh, <laughs> Yo, the ultimate imposter. Yo, this guy is a G. I No, get fucked, you dusty ass bitch. That's what you get. I thought you knew everything. You thought you knew everything, but you don't know jack shit. You don't know jack shit. You lost. I literally whispered to Aaron, I think it's Jalen, I think it's Jalen. So I'm a little mad, a little sour, a little broke. <laughs> I watched too much Survivor, man. Like, <laughs> first round, getting thrown in, I was tested to see if I was gonna trip up on my words, how much knowledge I actually had. So I'm like, if I go first, I can speak the most and make it seem like an accident. So I just want time to run out. So it felt good because people got annoyed and they didn't want to hear from me. So they pushed me aside and started talking to everybody else. That's yeah, smart. Yeah, he was talking the longest. And then she rushed. And the lady was like, no, I want to speak to everybody else instead of you. So he redirected the attention away from him because everybody felt like he spoke too long. And they started focusing on, oh, damn. My man's the ultimate. The ultimate imposter. One from my fam. I got one from my fam. I got one from me. One from my new Xbox. All right. I'm pretty. Yo, he should go. He yo. Imagine if he was fucked up. One from my burger that I'm about to eat. One from my McChicken I'm about to eat. Bug out. I would have bugged out, bro. One from my platano con salami. I'm gonna make sure I get a big ass salami. No pause. Full play on that shit, bro. Pretty frustrated because I think I could have won if I hadn't just been affected by everybody else's doubtfulness. I was um, reminded of the different perspectives of veganism. I don't think you can really like see a vegan. It's more like their thoughts and like their ideology and how they think about the world. Thanks for watching, guys. Get fucked. The comments. Aaron gets mad when someone says say cheese when someone takes a picture. After everything Aaron did, I'm glad she didn't win any money. Aaron is the most infuriating person in Jubilee video ever. I'm honestly surprised Aaron was vegan. This is due to the fact that she seems to have beef with everyone. I see what you did there. Imagine Aaron wasn't a vegan. That'd be the best acting ever on God. I'd vote Aaron just... I, that's what I was saying. I would have just voted her ass out just to vote her ass out. I vote Erin out just, to, just so she wouldn't have any share of the prize money. And also because I want peace and quiet. I hate how, like, 
it made Brandon feel very confused and questioned if he was actually vegan. Then he concluded that that he kind of isn't, and that was mostly thanks to Aaron. I mean, a. Not only is Aaron genu um generally disgusting person, she's also just wrong. Most of the things that she said wasn't vegan, is vegan. I don't know, bro. I honestly speaking, I don't give a flying fuck about veganism. I love chicken nuggets. I love hamburgers. I love steak. I love hamburgers again. I love steak and I love hamburgers again. I like carne asada. I like pernil. I love all that shit. 